Hey guys, welcome back to the kitchen. Yesterday we made this pretty, real pretty loaf of soap. And yes, it moved really quick on me. If you want to see that video, I'll have it linked down below. It is called Sugar Peaches. And somebody did tell me it does turn brown. As you can see, it is turning brown. I want to weigh this out before I cut it. I have my gloves to cut it. And it's in a towel, so I'm trying not to touch it a whole lot with my bare hands, but my hands, I just wash them. So this is 43 ounces. That's what this weighed out to be. And I want to put these on to finish cutting it. I should already have them on, but... We're gonna cut this baby today and see what she looks like on the inside because she moved really fast on me yesterday. And we're gonna see. I'm gonna move this up a little bit so you can still see. And I got this wire cutter on Amazon for a little under $100, I think. And cut off a end piece. Still kind of cute though. You may have to cut off just a little bit more. These are pieces I'll use for samples. So there is one bar and I did go back over the little peach slice and I'll keep calling it orange. It is an orange slice. So that's right about four ounces and as it cures it'll still lose a little bit of that. So I'm not wanting to try to cut a lot of my peaches off. Not bad though. Still kind of cute. It still has a little bit of a swirl going on the inside. But she moved really fast on me, so. If I'd have placed these better, I would have got a whole nother bar of soap out of this. It's okay. I've not soaked in a while. And you gotta get your groove back. Cute. Let's weigh this one. Four. So I'm staying pretty consistent here. It's a 4.4, .4, so a little bit bigger, and I did get a bubble where it was getting thick. Can you guys see that? That might be one I end up keeping for myself. Oh, that was really pretty. Two. 
4.2. I don't know if you guys can see the glitter on top of that or not. Probably not. But mica there turned out really pretty. Yeah, I could have got another bar out of that if I had to place my end bed's a little better. I have a really good end here on the ends. And just clean. Cut her off. Yeah, I have went on Etsy and looked at the bug cutter and a couple other cutters and found this one on Amazon for like 50 bucks around 50 bucks and then the um, shipping was kind of expensive but all together I think it was still under a hundred dollars if I can find the link I will leave it there's still out a live link I'll link it down below but that's it. She's all cut. That got me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I could have had nine if I'd have placed my embeds better. Nine bars. There's a really good sample. I will cut that into probably three pieces. For samples. like that three pieces but that's it guys that is sugar peach cut and four weeks it will be available I do have a Facebook page and that's probably where I'm going to sell from to start with is off my Facebook so if you're interested in a bar of soap you can leave me a comment down below and just check out the Facebook page which is the same name it is Moody Girl Soaps. And thanks for watching, guys. Take these gloves off. Oh, they're so cute. See ya.